Well, hello, all of my art students. Um, so to my guest teacher, specifically, uh, I'm only making one video today. Generally, I've got one for every one of my classes, but because we're on such a short time period today, I wanna keep things, uh, well, like I said, short, so that you guys can get right to work. So please, all of you bear with the other classes as I talk with you. Drawing students, I am really, really excited about this uh, artwork that you guys are doing. The Todd Rosinski piece based on shadows and cast shadows and really about the relationships you guys are finding between the imagery you're creating and the person that you're basing this on. Now I haven't really emphasized the idea of that third panel, that third artwork in the triptych, but if you've got that even in, as an inkling in your head, I think that the focus you guys are having with this project, I really believe that all of us can get that third piece in. So I'm very excited to hear that some of you are really super happy about this. So work, work, work. Don't forget to look at the goals I've got set up for you today and uh, stay focused and on task. So excellent drawing class. Uh, Studio Art 360, you guys are in the day three of solid painting, your Andy Warhol, Chuck Close, Frank Corb inspired artwork. Wait, scratch that Frank Corb. Let's say Alex Katz. I'll take a look at his work with you a little bit later. So you guys are working on these. One of the biggest things that I cannot emphasize enough is making sure that you're going one square at a time. And I, I emphasize that with a little staccato in my voice because it's very easy to flow from one square into the next without really thinking about it. If you've got any questions about it, my painting is up in the front of the room. Even the white space, I painted one square at a time. And one of your lovely classmates with incredible brilliance noticed that I had some sort of texture going on in it. And, and she thought it was a pattern, but it was the brush stroke. It was how I laid that paint down. So don't be afraid to incorporate some of that brush stroke. If you think that it's too thin, your paint is too much canvas showing through, you need to, <coughs> excuse me, you need to mix up a little bit uh, more paint in there. Just got back from a run. Uh, yes, of course, I run in shirt and tie. Uh, anyway, so you've got that. So one square at a time. Also remember to stay true to your color scheme. If you don't know what your color scheme is, you need to stop painting right now and really think about it. What is your color scheme for this painting? That's gonna be huge in the critique. So enough about AP Studio, nope, enough about Studio Art 360. AP Studio Art, you guys are doing great. You've got your Waterford Senior Living Project that you're working on. While I'm gone today, I'm gonna to be touching base with them over at Waterford Senior Living to see if we can figure out how and when we can have this artist reception. Now, I don't know all the names on the pieces that you've got, but we'll figure that out tomorrow. So continue working. Remember, you're doing three pieces based on that one, and I'm really happy uh, with, with what you're doing. Three pieces? No, 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 not, not three pieces. What is it, is it three pieces? I forget. Well, I know Mary's doing three pieces. Yeah, I think you guys are doing three pieces. It's a small concentration. Anyway, we'll figure things out. You just, you know what you're doing. You keep on doing what you're doing. So keep up the good work. And lastly, advanced drawing. You guys have probably got one of the more challenging pieces except from a piece studio art because you are totally on your own. This is a small concentration. You have to solve that for yourself. So make sure that you've got that taken care of. Um, all of your imagery is your own. There's no bad ideas. Everybody I have talked to, you've got great ideas. Some of you need to push it a little further than you are, um, but as long as you've got some really strong intent, you're doing just fine. Um, all of you, every single class, make sure that you're on page 26. We're at Wednesday. I know we've only got a few minutes of class, so I'm gonna shut up in just a second, but write down your goal, and at the end of class, before you clean up, take a minute and reflect on what you've done for the day, and the goals and the reflection are up on the board. That's all I've got. We'll see you guys tomorrow.
And uh, I've got to go. Uh, I got to go take care of dinner. So let me just. Uh, I'll see you. Stop in the video. All right. There we go. Video is stopped. What? Abby? The, well, the video is not stopped. Oh shoot. I guess I didn't stop the video. Bye.